Have you ever wondered why it is that you see things the way that you do? Why sometimes you will uh, explain something that you're seeing or your point of view, your perspective, which we're talking about, and someone else just totally won't get it. They won't understand. And that's because no matter how similarly you were raised, environment, city, even the same household, every individual is different. Every experience is different. We all have a different perspective. Now, sometimes we'll find similarities with other people, other individuals. There will be certain things that we see and they happen to see the same thing. They happen to see it the same way. But it's never going to be 100%. We all see the same thing. We all have the exact same point of view. Now, understanding what that means is very important because perspective, it ways and it affects and it impacts our our thoughts our emotions and our actions remember it's our point of view it's how we see things and a lot of times or sometimes or maybe most of the time it's not actually what's out there that we're seeing it just happens to be the way that we see it i hope that wasn't too confusing i think one of the most startling things about understanding and realizing that we all have a different perspective is when we talk to other people about things that we most assuredly see we're certain about something hey i know what this looks like i know exactly what i'm looking at right now i know what this situation is i know what this circumstance is but you compare that with someone else and what they see and it's completely different so even our thoughts right how does perspective shape our thoughts well when we construct a thought when we're thinking of something Right? We want to think about something. Maybe we're trying to make a decision or we're trying to come up with an idea. This is all going to be heavily influenced and shaped by what we're seeing in front of us. For instance, if we're looking to solve a problem and we're thinking about it, we first have identified that problem, what it looks like. And again, this is our perspective. This is our point of view. So it only really is dealing with that angle. However, if you were to ask 10 other people, to address the same problem, you may get 10 different answers, 10 different approaches. Now we can't be 10 different people all at once, but this goes back to the importance of continuously working on our perspective to ensure that we have the one that is most correct and most helpful that's gonna help us go forward. How does it, how do they shape our emotions? Well, just like thoughts, right? It's very, emotions are very, are very heavily influenced by how we acknowledge how we see and understand the current circumstance or situation. How we are seeing things is going to determine which emotion is going to be brought up. Right? And this is where perspective is, becomes very important. You can already see the importance that it holds over our lives. Because one adjustment, either in a positive manner or in a negative manner, is going to determine which emotion we bring about. Lastly, how does perspective shape our actions? Well, it goes back to what we've been talking about already. We talked about thoughts, we talked about emotions. Now, if I'm going to put something in, in place, now I have a plan. Now I'm going to take this step first. That's going to depend on how I see the situation. That's going to depend on what the world looks like around me in my season, in my circumstance, and how this appears to me. So again, it's very important to understand our perspective and it's very important to understand why we need to constantly, as often as we can, address our perspective and make sure that we are adjusting it, we are changing it, we are improving it to serve us best it shapes our thoughts, it shapes our emotions, and it shapes our actions. I hope you've learned a lot from this video today. Perspective is the theme of this week. 
understanding perspective and how important it is and how much it weighs in our lives and how much it affects our lives, you'll start to see how important it is and how significant it is to understand whether or not your perspective needs to change. I, for one, am an advocate of changing it as often as we can so that we can continue to see things clearly, especially if we're not able to see things very clearly at all. So again, thank you so much for watching my video. If you can, please subscribe if you haven't already. If you can hit the thumbs up button, that'd be great. If you leave a, a comment, I welcome those as well. Also in the description of my video, you'll find my Instagram and TikTok handle at live to learn coaching. You can reach me there, follow me for more content. If you have any questions, you want to send me a direct message, feel free to do so. You'll also find three opportunities to donate to my channel financially. Now that's not something that you absolutely have to do, but it does go a long way. It's very helpful in helping me prepare, set, a time, um, set aside the time and remain consistent in creating this content. So once again, thank you so much for your continued support and I hope you have a great day.